pumped with Sarantola's performance, I would assume? Yeah, we're very excited. Uh, probably need some Tums during some of those innings. But uh, that's we knew we were going to get that, and that's part of his progress and his growth is just learning how to manage innings and command. But he was really good today, had good stuff, and um, pissed out of a jam or two, but we were happy with it. Sort of a weird thing, but in every inning, once he got the first out, he got three outs in, in every inning, even when he got into trouble. Is that just a confidence thing with him, just a little quirk? What did you notice about that? That's part of it. I think that's part of it, just confidence. Of him going out there and pitching with command, and then when it's going bad for him, I think he thinks too much. And when he gets the first out, hey, let's play baseball and go at him. So he's just a young pitcher, being from Canada. Um, you know, he's pitched some, but getting out here and getting innings is going to be huge for him. But I thought his stuff was really good. What were some of your biggest takeaways from this weekend? I feel a lot better about our bullpen, like especially today. I felt like we ran some guys out there who, who had their stuff and pitched with their stuff and commanded their breaking balls. I was really pleased with that whole group that pitched today. Um, our young kids, Cameron, you know, James had a good weekend. Um, Landon Jordan had a good weekend. Logan Tanner had a good weekend. Um, I know I have a pretty good idea what Westy's going to do and Foss and all those guys, but watching some of those um, you know, young guys jump out there. Christian McLeod. I mean, we kind of know it, but you want to see him do it with the uniform on, and I think we saw that. You mentioned kind of the maturation of Eric. I mean, in some of those jams where he pitched himself into it last year, maybe he either wouldn't get through them or y'all would have to go to a different arm. I mean, today he got through them. How much of that is just, you know, a year of having that you know experience under his belt, just having a few more innings and sort of having that confidence? I think that's most of it. I mean, last year just trying to do too much. And this year he kind of – he gets it. He's been there. Um He's able to slow it down a little bit more and make some pitches. Scott Foxhall's done a great job with him. I mean, since he's been here, his stuff has grown. Uh, but also his pitchability and his maturity out there. Um, last year, Eric would have thought about the last pitch. And uh, they're really focused on, hey, next pitch, here we go, and, and just keep making pitches. And uh, we saw that today with some big punch outs. So with that, it seemed like Logan had a pretty good command of that, too, just talking to him in between innings and things like that. I mean, how much have you been seen from him and behind the plate been able to talk to pitchers? Especially a guy like Eric who maybe sometimes needs that, needs that a little bit. He's been good. I mean, he uh, he caught Eric the whole preseason, so we kind of had him lined out there. Um, but he, did, he did a great job, I thought. Just uh, caught the foul tip late. I forgot who was throwing. You know, that was Spencer's late. But just had some uh, – he didn't act like a freshman back there, which was good to see. How pleased were you with the way Landon Sims bounced back after Friday? Really pleased. I mean, he is uh, one of the better young arms in the country. And uh, you see it happen everywhere. Young guys are going out there pitching and just a little sped up. And that's why we wanted to get him out there, let him have some success. His stuff was really good today. I don't think they, they sniffed him. And uh, we need him. He's a big piece of our uh, bullpen. Pitching plans for Tuesday. Flipping a coin right now, so we have to uh, we have to assess everybody, see where they're at. It'll probably be a lot of guys on on. Tuesday. That's kind of why you see us all go a lot of guys today, because it's probably gonna be a lot of guys on Tuesday. Uh, I'm not exactly sure who the star will be, but I'll talk with Fox and we'll figure it out. And speaking of assessing with Tanner Allen, how, how's he feeling? He was better today, so I feel like we'd have him, uh, this upcoming week. We still got to get him out there and running around, but um, just you know a little precautionary. But playing the outfield and running around, kind of cold weather. Um, you know, we just got to get him, you know, full speed running out there. But he should be fine. Is there any box you didn't check this weekend? And when you look back over the weekend, I mean, is there anything that you're unpleased with? No, not really. I, I think we can do some things better. I mean, I think there were some, some pieces early in the weekend. And I'd like to get a couple more guys out there and get some opportunities. There's still some guys I need to see. Uh, we're pretty – we have some talent in, in our depth, you know, with some of the guys. Tanner Leggett was able to get out there late. But – He's going to help us and be a big piece of what we are. We just saw a lot of right-handed arms this weekend, too. So um, maybe getting some of our guys some more at-bats. With the way Cam swung the bat in the opening weekend, I mean, how much does that give you guys? And you mentioned maybe flip-flopping him and Landon. I mean, do you expect to still see that, or is it kind of Cam's? Well, I think over time things happen, matchups happen, right? I mean, I think you get some different – I think Cameron and, and LJ and Tanner, you know, they were pretty even going into the weekend. Tanner just hadn't been at third as long as the other two. So uh, the other two had a really good weekend, so it kind of, you know, slowed, slowed the playing time down a little bit. But I think they'll all play a lot as the season goes on. What is that like for you as a head coach just to see a guy like Cam come in and swing the bat the way he has and just sort of – It was know. good. It was good, especially to make plays. I mean, I just – some of the things with Cam you don't realize, he made some great plays on the weekend. And uh, we got to play one freshman. Usually some freshmen struggle defensively, and he runs out there and plays the game with a lot of poise at third. Anything else for Coach? Thanks, guys.